What my wife and I, Linda, both enjoy mostly about okay. coming to the parks here is that uh, in the middle of the afternoon, I can call her at work and say, hey, can you get off early? Let's, uh, let's go trail riding. Let's go down to Westwoods. Linda and I, we're going to go the other way so we can get a little cantering in and, and uh, see if we can meet you guys back at that creek. It's uh, so great to ride here in the parks. I grew up uh, in the next county, and we had plenty of room to ride in as a kid growing up. But now, um, if we didn't have this situation, if the park weren't uh, so willing to let not only us horse people, but people that walk their dogs and people that ride their bikes come here and use these facilities, um, we would all just be uh, trying to have a barbecue in our backyard. When I get up in the morning and I'm going to be doing something at the park, I, I get very anxious. I, I can't wait to get there and, and see all the people and socialize and, and see the naturalist. And sometimes I even go there early just because I enjoy the whole surroundings. <laughs> The Halloween Hound Hike is just people come with their dogs and some of them are dressed and some of them are not. Uh, we have fun looking at the different costumes and the different dogs and then we go for a hike and enjoy nature with our dogs. <laughs> This is one of the best blessings in my own backyard that a person could wish for. I love the way that Geauga County's Big Creek Park, um, it feels peaceful and quiet and safe. Um, I really enjoy coming out, spending time, and it's a little piece of heaven right here on Earth. Squirrel. Squirrel. The average Jar County resident doesn't have, you know, the thousands of acres of property that is available to them at the park system here. We just love the trails. There's just so many nice trails, whether it's winter time or springtime. I think it's kind of neat to be able to walk down the same trails now that we walked with our older kids uh, who are now grown and gone and we're still taking the same trails with our younger kids. <laughs> I like to come out here to, uh, to the Joggle Park District. Out here at best is nice because the, the docks are nice and it's close to home and uh, it's just a lot of fun to come out here and spend a day together, right? Right. I, I love uh, best because there's docks here and at other places there's no docks and uh, you have to fish from the edge and here there's the docks and you can get really close to water so you're able to catch more fish. It's awesome. Here we are in Orchard Hills today. We were just out cross country skiing a couple miles and uh, enjoying the beautiful, nice, cold northeastern Ohio weather that we've got today. It's literally five to ten minutes from where we live, and it just makes us feel great to be outside. You know, it makes you feel alive when you have a, a resource like this. You know, we, we, we love to work out and we love to be outside, and uh, this is the best.
that's why they filter it. Remember how they said they put it through the through the cloth? With saps arising, it was great for our family because we had the opportunity to see the sap actually coming to a boil and to see what that finished product not only looked like, but actually what it tastes like. children got to experience some of those things and to also um, listen to the different people explain how the process takes place. Back in the early days uh, when Geauga County was settled they had to contend with um, bears that might wander in and get a free drink from the sap bucket. As parents, we try really hard to expose our children to different opportunities to learn, and through the Geauga Park District, um, we've had that opportunity. We have three children with different levels of disabilities, and for each one of them, they've had the opportunity to experience some really great times, um, to make some memories that we will always have, and to really appreciate the natural surroundings that are here in our community. Go ahead, whichever way you prefer to do it. And then um, the way you're going to turn it is you're going to turn it to the right. That's good. Oh, wow. Very speedy. That's great. As parents, we're always looking for fun, unique things to do with our families. And if they can learn something along the way, all the better. Yeah, whoa. We're the, we're, we're the, the other one oh, swam away. Where are you going? Oh, it's okay. I can't tell you how proud I am to watch him grow, to watch him learn. Thanks to the Nature Scope program and the Jaga Park District, we've got that right here in our own backyard. Okay, let's see. What did you get this time? Uh, I really enjoyed the fact that we're looking at all the cool animals and insects and stuff that live out here. And it's just a lot of fun. It's something else. But that's but it could be, yeah. Oh, damn, so fly. Yeah, yeah, you're right. I thought yeah. that's a dragonfly. Yeah. Oh. 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 Oh.